Okay, welcome to a quick demonstration on <clears throat> ASUS's EEPC. I have a black EEPC on the left and a white EEPC <clears throat> on the right. The black EEPC has a 32 gig solid state, um, you know, two and a half inch hard drive. The EEPC on the right in white has a traditional 80 gig, two and a half inch hard drive. The boot up times are significantly different. So I'm going to press, they're, they're both running on only battery power, they're not plugged in. I'm going to press the power button at the same time and we'll watch them boot up. As you can clearly see, the uh, black P EEPC with the memory card SSD solid state uh, hard drive is significantly faster. Still booting. Oh, there he goes. It's about caught up. Okay, so it's about a, you know, significant difference. All right, let's shut the machines down, and then we'll look at the install on the bottom. Press the button at the same time, and the machine on the right, um, actually on the left, the memory card machine shuts down right away. Looks like the hard drive based EEPC not quite ready to shut down yet. The uh, Windows install on these machines are ghost copies. So they are 100% bit for bit identical. Still shutting down. Okay, while we wait for the white one to shut down, let's look at the bottom of the black EEPC. And you can see we have a Samsung <coughs> SSD flash installed with the, <coughs> you know, IDE interface cable. This machine is still shutting down, but we're going to flip it over anyway. And we'll have a look at the traditional. Uh, 80 gig Samsung hard drive. As you can see, uh, just a traditional 80 gig with the same type of interface. There you go. There you have it. Conclusive proof. SSD drives are fast. I gotta get the door.